Why, hello there! My name is Freckress, and welcome back to Let's Play Grim Fandango. I'm in Maximo's office, I believe, and I guess it's just time to talk to him. We'll look at him first, though. There's, there's stuff. Hello, Maximino. Why, if it ain't Manny Calavera, come to see how the big boys play, eh, Manny? From what I can tell, they play with kitties. Kitties, Bye. roulette tables, what's the difference? They go round and round all day, and they're both more reliable when they're fixed. Am I right? <laughs> True. Alright, how's the old cat how's race? The old cat race, Max? Well, volume's pretty low. Most everybody's out of town. Tell me about it. But well, I mean, it is the day. Businesses that help smooth over the rough spots. What kind of side businesses? <laughs> Manny, let's just say our El Mato associates appreciate our out-of-town perspective. <laughs> oh, okay. You know, you got a pretty nice setup here. You got a good little club yourself, Manny. Not as nice as my girlfriend's, of course. Huh? <laughs> Did you say your girlfriend? Hey, Manny, don't pretend you don't hear the gossip. It's not a secret anymore. Olivia and I are officially an item. <laughs> I just just rat him out. Well, I just saw Olivia and Nick kissing. Manny, we all kiss here. We're all one big family. You know? Oh, okay. No, I mean kissing, Max. <laughs> no, I mean kissing, Max. Manny, Olivia and I are in love. Nick Virago's been my trusted counsel for years. You shouldn't even joke around about their character like that. It could make me very angry. I'm not joking. I'm not joking. That's enough, Calavera. I mean it now. <laughs> Let's talk about something we can agree about. <laughs> okay, I'm here for I'm Charlie's, here for Charlie's money. money. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's not gonna happen. No, seriously. He says you have a lot of it. Oh, I got a lot of it, but none of it's his. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I like the new blimp. Yeah, I decided not to let what happened to the Olivia One get me down. Aww. Imagine, you try to impress your girlfriend by building her a beautiful airship, and what happens? It goes and crashes, explodes and burns on your own track. It kills her favorite cat, too. Aww. It's the kind of thing that makes the young girl's heart go flutter. I'll tell you that twice. I'll tell you that twice. Your new waiter's got quite an attitude, even for a snooty waiter type. Hey, Manny, when you put labels like that on people, it's like you <laughs> stick people in these little boxes and never let them out. Oh. We're all in little boxes back home, Max. Six feet under. Now you're talking like the town corner, Manny. Cut it out. <laughs> Cut it out. I'm leaving town tonight. That's great, Manuel. No one needs a vacation more than you. Get out of town. Forget about that Meche woman. Well, I'll let you get back to staring out the window. I'm not going to forget about her. I'm going to go find cats. it. Can't get enough of my cats. You know, I'm getting the feeling Max ain't much of a dog guy. <laughs> you think? If I know Max, these will be wired to an alarm. You know. Oops. If I know Max, these will be wired to an alarm. You know me better than I thought. <laughs> Very impressive trophy collection. Paws of fire. Every one of my babies. <laughs> All right. More trophies. I mean, is that all we're doing here? Alright. Not much I can do there. Because he's got them all wired. I don't have anything for him. Still gotta figure out how to get that key. Uh... <laughs> oh, where's that leading me? Uh-oh, I'm in a loop. Okay. <laughs> so, what I'm thinking is there was a demon that rolled one of these guys down there. And if I'm remembering correctly, that's where Charlie's money is. It's down, down there in the cellar. So I gotta figure out how to hide in this and get over there. And what did we say about Gladys? It's the VIP pass for the High Rollers Lounge that Chow Chilla Charlie gave me. Ooh, better not show that to Gladys. Better not show it to Gladys. Let's go show it to Gladys. <laughs> that's really, that's my only lead. All right. How do I get to my place fast? I think I go this way. 
Oh man, I gotta do this. Ugh. All right, I skipped that for you. The magic of editing! So that uh, you don't have to go nearly as long as I did to get here. All right. Whee! All right, so like I said, we're gonna... That's not what I needed. We're gonna show this to Gladys. Makes Check sense, out I this guess. Fancy pass to the High Rollers Lounge. Can you believe how full of themselves they are over there? <laughs> I don't think their place is any more VIP than ours, do you? <laughs> I don't know. I, I try to stay away from that place. Really? Why? Because of my 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 problem. What kind of problem you got, buddy? Gladys? Compadre? Oh. Aha. Uh -huh. All right, let's pick that up real quick. That's not real quick, Manny. Ah, Marillo de Oro, a very fine liqueur filled with solid gold flakes. Yes, I better take this with me for safekeeping. Aha. Uh -huh. Why? Why do I need that? I don't know. I'll have it for later. All right. So now I'm gonna go back. So I'll be right back. Okay. Here we are. Let's see if uh, Gladys came this way. Ding. You got it. What? Oh, baby. oh, he's a gambler. Oh, for crying out loud. Go, go, go. <laughs> hey. If I had only known. <laughs> I had no idea you liked gambling so much, Gladys. Well, the doctors made me promise I wouldn't do it anymore. But they can't get in the high rollers loud, Doc, can they? <laughs> he drunk. <laughs> pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad. Oh, okay. Get up, you stupid cat! You stupid Get cat. Ah, Marillo de Oro. A very fine liqueur filled with solid gold flakes. I don't know if I'm supposed to get him more I drunk. I really want to do that. Okay. That's not it. <laughs> you got it! Do I have anything else? Looks like a turkey baster. Uh, it sure is. Why do I have a turkey baster? I don't really want to do that. Okay. Wait. You got it. Get up, you stupid cat! All right. Pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad. That's the sugar Baba likes. <laughs> All right. That didn't work. Uh. Yeah. I guess I need a way in. Like I know I I I know I need to do this. It's very obvious. So I found a thing. It says revolutionary design leaves can edges safe and smooth for kitty. Oh, so they can eat directly out of the can. Nice. Great. Now it smells like a giant cat litter box and some sort of gelatinous demon mystery meat product in here. <laughs> Wet foods for winners. I don't need the hernia. Mmm, smells good. But I'd rather eat my own arm. But you don't have a tongue, so it doesn't really matter. Anyway, I have a can opener. Maybe I can can open the wine. I know that sounds silly. I need a, I need a corkscrew. Oh, That's what I need. Okay. Uh, okay. Use it. Use it on this. No. Oh. 
There we go. Yeah. I'd better not open it when it's full. That could spill a lot of juice. Oh man. That monster upstairs is running there ragged. Oh, but Monsieur, je suis très. There are no guests allowed in the kitchen. Oh, I must sorry. Ask you to leave. In a minute, Leroy. Raoul. <laughs> Where? <laughs> the can opener wouldn't work there. That's fine. Let's just just work it. Not picking that up. There we go. What are you doing? Nothing. I wanted some wine. Oh, look at what a mess you have made. Get out of here. Hey, what about my vino? It's not self-serve. You'll just have to wait until I get around to it. Oh, for crying out loud. Uh. <laughs> Does that mean it's empty? I told you to stay out of here. I wouldn't have to come in here if the service were a little faster. Hmm. <laughs> That's a good cat. Je vous prie de m'excuser, monsieur. Sorry. Almost there. What are these? They're lights. Oh, if I had only known. Are you sure? What's that? I don't really want to do that. Oh man. You're doing it. <laughs> I don't really want to do that. You're doing it. Oh, okay. <laughs> huh. Go, go, go. Not Run. Not sure. I thought I had it. But I do not. Meow baby. Meow, baby. Hmm. Ah, Garçon. Can I use this with him? He's probably gonna walk all the way over there and tell me no. I don't really want to do that. Okay. <sighs> hmm. Okay, so I can't give the booze to Gladys. Maybe I can get this metal detector. Oh, let's do this. Oh, beep, beep, beep. Sir, if you will, please place all of your belongings on the security desk. Ah, uh, no. Oh, you're clean. Oh, okay. Rats, man. I gotta drink it. To strip search you. So let's drink it. Well, maybe just a sip. Even though gold shouldn't react on a metal detector because it's not uh, metallic or uh, magnetic. That's the one. All right, put it back. Go through again. I got an achievement, so that might have been it. Sir, if you will, please place all of your belongings on the security desk. Okay. Still beeping. You sure you're not packing anything else? Nothing that would set off that uh, thing. So no, I'm sure I'm, sure I'm not drunk. <laughs> Rules are rules. <laughs> and of course, with my dad being in the military, we moved around a lot. Mm -hmm. I remember this one town we moved to when I was in the first grade. Oh, really? Yeah, the only industry in the area was figs. Acres and acres of fig trees everywhere you looked. I myself never really cared for figs. I always liked dates more. Oh. Or prunes. 
Don't you just love prunes? They have such a great texture. <laughs> They're all wrinkled up like my grandma Hedwig's face. Oh, poor grandma Hedwig. She was always forgetting things. Speaking of metal detectors. <laughs> Did you just come back here to ask to borrow my metal detector? No. Oh, okay. Now, where was I? Oh, yeah. So the only industry in town was figs. Acres and you acres of fig trees everywhere you looked. I myself never really cared for figs. I always liked I dates think more. just at the part about your metal detector. <laughs> Are you sure you didn't just come back here for this metal detector? Actually, I did come back here just for your metal detector. Actually, I did come back here just for your metal detector. What is it with you in this thing? I'm sick of it, Manny. If this is all you want, you can fight the cats for it. Why is it all men are after the same thing? Except you. The only woman you care about is that Colomar dame, and she split on you. I don't know what she did to you, but you know what? I'm done trying to figure it out, pal. Oh, okay. <laughs> Why don't you just tell her? <laughs> Sorry, Carla. All right. Well, it landed in the cat Bye, box. Carla. Drop dead. Already dead. So I'm gonna go to the cat box and see what I can do. Why do you have to walk down those stairs? Why can't you run down those stairs? It would make sense. Anyway. Well. That's the hole I saw Carla's metal detector fall through. Oh no. <laughs> yep. Can I use, like, my scythe or something? <laughs> it beeped when I took it out. My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Uh -huh. Aha. Aha. Uh -huh. Scoop. Got it. Okay, that was a little easier than I expected. I got it, but now it smells like cat. Uh, stinky, waste. Could be <laughs> yeah. <laughs> See? All right, what am I using the metal detector for? What metals do I need to detect? Hmm. Hmm. I think it's just picking up my blade. Hmm. I think. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Indeed. What is this, anyway? <laughs> Phase through. Oh. I mean, okay. There it is. Max's giant cat racetrack. How's a regular guy with three roulette tables supposed to compete with that? Carefully. Okay, what is this place? There's a place I could tie a rope. What? Why didn't I see this before? Uh. All right. <laughs> Slow going. Okay. Got a tattooist making bone tattoos, which should really just be paint. Strong stuff. That ought to kill the pain. Should, but it don't. I kill the pain, turn off my drill, stop working. How about that? No, no, no. I can take it. Bring it on, pops. I'll pop you, sailor boy. <laughs> Weird. Don't drink alcohol when getting your tattoo. It thins your blood and makes it really hard to frickin... Oh, that reminds me. I forgot about my date with Inez. Who? Makes it hard for your tattooist. Not picking that up. 
Hello, operator? Yeah, it's me, baby. How'd you know? <laughs> hey, don't say that, sweetheart. You know I meant to stop by and... Oh, okay. I'm more happy about leaving town every minute. Uh, not now, Manny. I'm in the middle of something with Naranya here. Oh. Naranya? We pronounce it three different ways in this game already. I told you, Calavera, not now. All right. Whoop! I need that. You need to hold still, or I need to strap you down. So I gotta poison that, I guess. I don't think I can use. Is the gold stuff gone? Oh, it's still there. There's stronger stuff than that in there already. Oh, okay. All right. Who are you? Well, Looks you're Naranja. Like right, huh? Looks like it hurts. Oh, we're not gonna talk to him. Looks like it hurts. Oh, okay. Talk to the tattooist. Caterpillar? Me and Shag fight alone. Me and them fool your bell fight. Is that Polish? <laughs> if it's not, I'm I'm not trying to be offensive. I just don't know that language. That's one old fridge. Looks like a lettuce crisper. Smells more like a fungus crisper to me. Gross. Might as well. It's empty. What? Hey, shut door. You slowed down my grinder. Very painful. Very painful, eh, Naranja? Oh, oh the power. Gosh. Okay. <laughs> okay, since this, <laughs> we're just running on the generator, it diverts power. We'll figure out why we need to do that, but... A lot of stains for a guy with no bodily fluids. That's kind of gross. I really doubt I'll be touching that anytime soon. I really doubt okay. I'll be touching that anytime soon. All right. So, is that all that's in here? Just the two? Yep. All right. So, like I said, I need to, like, poison it or something. I Maybe... I don't know. We'll figure that out in the next episode. I'm gonna go ahead and leave this here. So thank you very much for joining me. Check out annotations for other videos that I've done. Share, subscribe, and socialize, and all the other fun stuff in the YouTubes down there. Hopefully I'll see you in my next video, and my prickly face is out of here. Bye!